Hello. One of the great pleasures in my life has been going around talking to groups of people, using my love of photography and of music to share with them uh, memories of some of the wonderful places that it's been my privilege and pleasure to visit over the years. Unfortunately, COVID and the lockdown crisis has brought this to a halt. So I thought that I'd put together a little video which shares with you just some of the places that we visited over the years. I do hope you enjoy looking at them. A few years ago, my wife had a significant birthday. I thought I'd treat her and ask her if she wanted to be taken away somewhere for a few days. Now bear in mind her birthday is in January. Uh, I was a little bit surprised when she suggested a visit to the Ice Hotel in Sweden. Um, we had a wonderful few days there. Um, temperature in the bedroom was minus five degrees. Um, outside minus 33 degrees, believe it or not. And the real bonus of this was that we had a wonderful display of the Northern Lights while we were there. So I thought I'd take you there. Chilly start to this, um, this entertainment uh, with some music by Jacques Lussier. Hope you enjoy looking at it. So, after that rather chilly start, let's go somewhere warmer. Let's travel south to Australia. When I retired a few years ago, we went on a long holiday, part of which we spent in Australia. 
and part of that time we actually stayed for two or three days in a hotel by Darling Harbour in Sydney. Sydney Harbour was quite spectacular and we spent a fair bit of time either walking around it or driving around it, going across it by ferry or uh, most probably most memorably with a wonderful helicopter flight when we saw from above the bridge and the opera house which everybody associates with Sydney Harbour. So what about the music? Well we're thinking of the operatic theme. We, we've gone for the Pearl Fisher duet from the opera of the same name and also the humming chorus from Madame Butterfly. So here we go to Sydney.
So we've been north, we've been south. Let's go east. Let's go east to China. Now, a little bit about music. Uh, my taste in music is fairly wide ranging. Uh, so we've had a bit of classical music, uh, some opera. How about something a little bit lighter? Sometimes the, there's a problem in finding the music to match the slides or the images, but in this particular case, um, the choice was made for me. We were in China, we were in Beijing, in fact, when Katie Muller released her album with a track on it, There Are Nine Million Bicycles in Beijing. So the choice was made for me. So here we go with some bicycles in Beijing and Katie Mellua. Having travelled north, south, east, we've got to go west. Where shall we go? Well, I've always had a great love of wildlife photography. And so a visit to the Galapagos Islands had always figured high on my wish list. Um, 
And the trip that we made there finally really matched up to all our expectations. About 13 islands, plus a few smaller ones, uh, 600 miles to the west of the coast of South America, um, ranging from volcanic and barren in the west to slightly more fertile and greener in the east. And in many ways, the, the animal life that we saw matched up to this terrific variety in the landscape. So what about music? Well, uh, I've used music from the IMAX film to the Galapagos Islands, and I hope that sort of sums up the, the, the feel, the general feel that we had about the place. So a spectacular trip, and I do hope that you enjoy the photography and the music.
that brings us to the end of the trip. North, south, east and west. If you're still with me, I hope you've enjoyed sharing the trips with me. If we're still in the COVID period, um, I hope that it's helped in some small way to ease the, um, the stresses that have come with the restrictions that have been imposed on us during the COVID crisis. But thank you for watching.